Alright guys, it is me, me the movies, here with the second to last episode in Joey's campaign. Today's episode, Imposter. This imposter is referring to the uh, Winged Dragon of Ra. First of all, this cutscene is super epic. I mean, that's just like the epicest Merrick thing I've seen. Alright, now, uh... This is a different encounter with the uh, with the God card compared to uh, Dark Knight and Nightmare, in the fact that um, there are, there are no healing bases, and you only have to fight Merrick once. Um, re the Winged Dragon of Raw is automatically level 99, so um, you know he doesn't get any stronger. And to me, this is the easiest uh, God encounter, so you know it's pretty easy. Uh, Ra does not have any special abilities, such as, uh, well, it has, uh, Almighty Blaze Nova and Almighty Blaze Cannon, but, uh, its attacks don't do anything special, like, with Obelisks, um, but Sly, the only one that has special abilities is Slifer, its Thunderbolt summons decreases attack by a lot, um, unfortunately, none of your marshals right now have the ability Match of the Egyptian Gods, so, um, you can't use a god on god fight, so it's just your monsters versus Ra. And you always have to watch this cutscene, which I think takes long. Long and it's kind of lame. Although it is epic, but the, the wait is uh, just brutal. Uh, and you do have to watch this every time you use Eye of Ra. Compared to Slifers and Obelisk Entrance, this one takes like a long time. But it, uh, again, it's pretty epic. Um. See, I think it has 9,999 9, 9, attack, defense, and uh, HP. Nope, 8,657 HP. Right, right off the bat, let's use Regaki to uh, roughly 1,000 damage. Um, let's use Moonlight Extinction to lower that attack a little bit. That'll uh, even the playing field out a little bit. Let's use uh, a Raimi. That'll paralyze him. Now let's let's start wailing on him. Let's see how much damage I can do before this team is defeated. Six 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 six. Right, Orion being angry at Raw. And let's use that final flame. Do another thousand-ish damage. Ooh, that did a lot. Um. Uh, Ra's attacks are Almighty Blaze Cannon, which attacks one person, and Almighty Blaze Nova, which uh, attacks two people. Eh, he missed. That's funny. Um, okay, moisture creatures attack or action points are are done for. Ooh, got a critical. Awesome! Looks like I'm going to be able to get all my attacks off before, at least before he uh, defeats this team. As long as he doesn't get any criticals, of course. Let's see if I can't paralyze him. Hopefully I won't miss. No, I don't miss. This should paralyze him. And it does. Cool. Another Orion's Anger. Doing the job right. Man, I'm doing a lot of damage compared to when I fought Slifer. This fight is going way better. Ra is almost helpless against me. Ha ha. I feel powerful now. Alright, uh, Orion the Battle King's atta uh, action points are done. I may see if I can make my team survive through this. What I'm going to do is, uh, once my monsters take enough damage from Ra's attacks, I'll use Gist of the Mystical Elf and hopefully be able to survive. We will see. Going after a uh, moisture creature. Uh... Not a whole lot of damage, so I'll just wait another turn. Okay, now he's using Almighty Blaze Nova. And that is gonna attack all of my people. I moved the I moved the screen back a little bit, because I've noticed that if you're closer, um that makes the uh, game uh, lag a little bit. So try and get the screen out a little bit. Alright. Oh, uh, he's gonna use another Almighty Blaze Nova. I already used my gift of the mystical elf, and I'm out of action points, so I can no longer heal. So, we'll see if this team can survive. Ooh, he missed a moisture creature. He's getting another Almighty Blaze Nova. And his points are climbing up 
pretty fast. Looks like he's going to overtake Giselle's points easily. Uh, and he takes out uh, both my monsters, except Moisture Creature. And he is going to overkill Moisture Creature as long as... Well, I bet Moisture Creature can survive this. Oh, uh, no, he got a critical. Never mind. Overkill, baby. Not good. Um, well, that sucks. Actually, I've got a team in mind that could uh, defeat Merrick. Let's see. There you are. He's third in line. Come here, Tristan. Tristan, Tristan, Tristan. I always like this team. It's nice and intimidating, and it's really good against Badlands monsters. It's cool. Tis cool. Slowly approaching. And now, second fight against Wing Dragon of Ra. This fight should go pretty fast since he only has roughly 1700 HP. Not doing a whole lot of damage, um, but that's because uh, this team is built to fight Badlands monsters, so that's why we're not doing super damage. But it's enough, it'll be enough to defeat him. Uh, he gets out of confusion. But that's okay, because uh, this will probably be his last attack before, before he dies. Uh, one attack. Oh, and I missed. Well, that sucks. Um, luckily, though, uh, Song of the Thunder and Giant, Stone, or Giant Soldier of Stone both have uh, Silver Bow and Arrow, which makes their attacks automatically hit no matter what. So, Ra has just been defeated by Tristan's team. Huzzah! And, sad enough, it turns out that this Raw, I'm guessing it's not the real Raw, or I'm guessing he thought that Raw was unbeatable, or something like that, because he gets real depressed that I defeated him, and he's, uh, he, he just acts like he's been tricked or something. It's kind of sad. Well, anyway, you get the Eye of Raw, but this is not the last mission. Next mission is Invincible Imperial Guard, where you fight Kaiba. There are indeed some monsters to get there, and you'll see that in the next episode. So, while I am talking to you, I would like to say, if you guys like my videos, uh, throw me a like, comment, subscribe, I'd really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in the last episode of Joey's Campaign. See you then.